A colostomy is a surgical opening into the colon, also known as the bowel or the large intestine. But before I explain colostomy surgery, let's review digestion to help understand how the surgery can affect our body. When we eat, we chew our food and it goes down our esophagus and into the stomach. In the stomach, that chewed food is held, stored, and churned as it's met with digestive enzymes and then slowly released to travel into the small intestine. And as it moves into the small intestine, more digestive enzymes are added to help break the food down so the vitamins and nutrients can be extracted and used for fuel for our bodies. You can say that the small intestine eats for us. Now from the small intestine, the chewed food is going to move into the large intestine, also known as the colon. And as I said earlier, the small intestine eats for us, well the large intestine drinks for us. It absorbs the liquid from the liquid that we drink and from the liquid in the food that we eat. And the more colon that we have, the more opportunity for the absorption of liquids our body will have. Now the remaining chewed up food is going to go ahead and move through the colon and exit the body through the anus. Now let's review colostomy surgery. A colostomy is a surgical opening into the colon. The surgeon will separate the GI tract and then either remove the remaining section or suture it closed. Now to allow the stool to exit the body, the surgeon will create a diversion by making an opening on the abdominal wall. Then the surgeon will bring the open end of the GI tract out through this opening on the abdominal wall, fold this section of GI tract over and suture it down to the body. This will be known as the stoma, and this is where the stool is going to exit the body. The person can wear a pouch over it to collect the stool. If you would like more information about ostomy surgery or ostomy management, contact the UOAA at ostomy.org. Thank you.